Hi guys, now I'm back inside and I'm going to show you what we need to make our frog. Now, I hope you have construction paper at home. I didn't, so yesterday I had to paint the colors that I needed. So I need green for my frog and then I need a red and I'm going to make two big circles on the red construction paper. So I'm going to cut these out right now and he's going to have really big eyes, this frog. So I'm going to cut out his, I'm going to cut out his circle. I'm going to cut out another circle because we have one, two eyes. Okay. And then what you need to do is cut out one long strip of red. Okay, so those are going to be his mouth, no, not his mouth, Mrs. Bowman, his tongue and his eye, all right? I don't have construction paper, so I just have to fold this so that it looks like a tongue. Up, up, up. So there's my long tongue, that's going to be a tongue, and these are going to be his eyes. Now, in school, what I usually use is the paper plate, and I cut the paper plate in half, cut it in half. But I don't have a paper plate here today. I mean, I didn't use a paper plate, so I'm just gonna cut out the green, okay? I'm gonna fold it in half, my green. Okay. And then I'm just gonna cut out so it looks like a rounded, oops, I didn't cut both sides. So it kind of looks like that. Okay, now I'm gonna take the eyeball and I'm gonna put in here. But first, if you look really closely at your eye, there is two different colors and that's what we're gonna to do to this frog as well. So I'm gonna take a black marker that I have and I'm gonna draw, look, I'm just gonna draw one line right down the center. If I want to do make it a little thicker, I can draw two lines down the center. So I'm gonna do that to the other one also, okay? I'm gonna draw a line down. So now, hold up my marker. So now, look at that, they're my eyes. So then I'm gonna take my frog and I'm gonna put my eyes behind. You can glue your eyes on the front or behind. I'm going to put my, I'm going to glue mine behind, okay? So I'm going to take my glue right here and I'm going to glue it behind. Okay, well right now I'm going to take tape, make it go faster. <gasps> Look at that, Mrs. Willimon. I really should have glued it down because that's what we need. That's what I should have done. Let me glue it down so that it stays. My piece of tape, I was trying to do it quickly, but don't do that. Now I have my glue down. Mrs. Willimon. So there is my frog. Now my frog, frog, are very unique because they use their tongue to catch flies. So this is gonna be my tongue. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my marker or if you have a pen or something, and I'm just gonna roll the tongue on my marker like that. See that? So now when I take it off, when I slide the marker out, look at this. It's like a little spongy little tongue. And I'm going to put that on my frog. Okay. Now I'm going to glue that on my frog. Alrighty. There is my frog. Isn't he cute? If you want to put little designs in here, if you have more paint and you want to put yellow or blue or you want to put some spots on him, I can even use my black marker if I want and I can just put some little decoration on him. He's 
really cute. So this is a big eyed frog. There you go. He's sticking his tongue out. He's cute. All right, guys, I hope you have a really great day. It looks a little rainy up here in my neighborhood. And if I happen to find a frog the rest of this week, I'll try to just put that on there for my stream. Okay, bye guys.